Good day, good day. It's God Says Ministries, the House of Fire, and I'm Prophet Tavis. So we got quite a bit to go through in this video today. Um, I'm bringing out the uh, words that God gave me um, some time back, which I believe are all going to be manifesting in themselves in uh, oh, the next three, four months, and even maybe less. So the first word I want to go through was on the 20th of September 2020. And I'll read that one and I'm going to read into the other one, which was on the 24th of April 2020. Um, yeah, 24th of April 2020. So, yeah, let's, let's go through them. Um, Without me they shall bow down among the prisoners, and they shall fall among the slain. For all this my anger is not turned away, but my hand is stretched out still. A sign will be seen and a sound will be heard as a renaman sing with one voice a new song. And I will breathe new life into the land of the brave and set freedom loose once again. And you will know that the God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob walks among you. For a day, for a day is coming that every man will hear the truth, and those confused will be many. The streets will be filled with the lost. But I have set aside righteous mouths of power, filled to the brim with healing oil. This day is on the horizon and is known by my prophets. Prophets who have stood faithfully through many, many days of ridicule. For I will no longer stand for the injustice and will place my hand upon the scales of time. The time has come and it will be revealed to the people lost and confused by deception. The veil of the deceiver will be removed and their boldness exposed. Their nakedness will be visible to all. Their wailing will be heard around the world as they cry out to their gods to save them. But their gods have, are powerless, their gods are powerless in my presence. I will shake the ground beneath them, beneath their feet, and their ivory towers will crumble under them. There will be a force, no, no. they will be forced into the light, and the streets and highways will know their names and the ways in which they have walked. There will be no hiding place, no place to hide their face, nor the work of their hands. I will flood the streets with foot soldiers of my choosing and anoint their hands with compassion and healing. I will kindle a fire in many hearts and a generation will be born in a day. In the coming weeks, idols will crumble under the weight of my glory, and governments will know my name. So that is two prophecies that um, 
I wanted to bring out from the archives that are stored on my computer to your attention because I believe we're in the time in that time but so that was the on the one was on the uh, 20th of September the other one was on the 24th of April 2020 and uh, I read them as one, basically. I didn't stop and say, this is the next one. But you can sort of see me change over. So, there's another prophecy that I put out the other day about, it talks about, uh, there's a twin in the ground. And uh, it will uh, come on, basically, uh, and cause destruction, basically, an earthquake. Um, seven and a half dozen of the other the words were seven and a half dozen of the other now we've just had a oh yesterday not we but I mean Japan just had a 6.6 .6 earthquake yesterday on the 22nd you know 22 20 22 on the sec 22nd of uh, January they had a 6.6 .6, uh, earthquake and you, I know I put out the video yesterday about Donald Trump, or the day before, about Donald Trump, or yesterday actually, about Donald Trump having his anniversary, 17th anniversary, on the 22nd of January 2020. But we had, Japan had a 6.6. .6. So 6 plus 6 is 12. So... It'll come on the heels of its other seven and a half, seven and a half dozen of the other, put it that way, is what we say. So seven and a half dozen of the other. So 7.6, half dozen, that is six plus six is 12. Half a dozen is six, 7.6. So it's going to be a whole magnitude stronger than the one that was in Japan yesterday. And uh, I believe this is coming for the east, the west coast, the west coast of the um, United States. On the west coast, specifically uh, California. And the prophecy says that ivory tire towers will crumble. Who lives in ivory towers? You know, the elite. Hollywood? Yeah. Another thing this, the Spirit spoke to me about today, was well, actually speaking for a while, but he, he mentioned it today. And I'll put this in the video at the end. Uh, 23rd of January 2022 the world market will collapse in the next three months and gold and silver will rise you know the Bible says God says the silver is mine and the gold is mine he doesn't mention anything else he says the silver is mine and the gold is mine and I heard these in the spirit today the world market will collapse in the next three months and gold and silver will rise. In other words, God's going to rise and when He rises, so will the God of gold and silver. Gold and silver. Another thing today is the Spirit <laughs> going to sound strange because I'm talking about 2020-22. The 22nd of February and the 23rd of February, but it's actually only one day, 24 hour period. So from the 22nd of February, noon, to the 22nd, uh, 23rd of February, noon, 24 hour period, so you could say one day, one day, one night, uh, I believe something biblical is going to be happening. God's going to, I have this, 
well, I, I just feel it, I hear it, I sense it that something biblical is going to happen in that 24 hour period. So from the 22nd of February, from noon, to the 23rd of February, to noon, 24 hours. So that's a, that's a day basically, 24 hours, 24 hours. So yeah. Um, something biblical is going to happen. Something biblical. And uh, another thing that, that um, the Spirit has put on my heart to talk about is Kim Clement's Trump will become a trumpet. Trump shall become a trumpet. It goes like this. Trump shall become a trumpet, says the Lord. Trump shall become a trumpet. That's two trumpets. I will raise up the trump to become a trumpet and Bill Gates to open up the gate of a financial realm for the church, says the Lord. Now these are Kim Clemens part of Kim Clemens' prophecy, and this was, if coming up this April would have been 15 years ago, 4th of April, coming up to this April would be 15 years ago. So, we know Trump has become a trumpet, but there's Trump shall become a trumpet, says the Lord, and he said it. Trump shall become a trumpet. This is the second time he says it. I will raise up Trump to become a trumpet. So basically, Trump will become a trumpet, says the Lord, is virtually the same as I will raise up Trump to become a trumpet. Instead of Tim saying, the God using says the Lord, I will raise up because that is the Lord, right? So there's two trumpets there. Two trumpets there. Trump shall become a trumpet, says the Lord. Trump shall become a trumpet, says the Lord. And Bill Gates, and Bill Gates to open up the gate of a financial realm for the church, says the Lord. So, I will raise up Trump to become a trumpet, is basically what the Lord said, says the Lord. So, there's two trumpets. Trump will become a trumpet, says the Lord. Trump will become a trumpet. I will raise up Trump to become a trumpet. Okay, that's the same as saying, says the Lord. And build gates to open up a, the f gate to a financial realm for... For the church, says the Lord. <coughs> so, in, 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 um, this is what the Holy Spirit is showing me anyway. Uh, in Kim's prophecy, he has two trumpets, Trump becoming a trumpet twice. And uh, on his second trumpet, on the second trumpet, Bill Gates will be raised up. Uh, and open a gate to the financial realm for the church, says Lord. Right? Bill Gates will open, okay, not raise them. Bill Gates will open up a gate of financial. Right. Now, we know Bill Gates is, is or was the wealthiest man in the world, or still is. So how does he become a financial, open up a gate of financial realm for the church? Well, it's quite simple. You just take all the money that he, is, that he has and you give it to the church. So what God is going to say, yeah, and Bill Gates to open up a gate of financial, of the, a financial realm. So his financial realm is going to be opened up 
as God says, I'll give you the treasures of darkness. I'll give you the treasures of darkness. Those that are hidden in secret places. Bill Gates has got a lot more hidden away. So Bill Gates' gate is going to be opened up. And Bill Gates to open up the gate of a financial realm. In other words, he's talking about a financial realm. It's the financial realm that Bill Gates has been operating in all these years. In darkness, I'll give the treasures in secret places hidden in darkness. In darkness, going to open that gate up. And that realm is going to come to the church, says the Lord, according to Kim's prophecy. So, on the, 20, on the 4th of April 2022, will be 15 years. 15 years since Kim spoke this prophecy. And 15 means the rest of God. To rest in the rest of God. So we're coming, as I said, we're in the rest of God. And even uh, Bob Jones said this, this decade will be the rest of God. If you can go back to Bob Jones. So we're coming into the rest of God this decade. And uh, he's going to take Bill Gates' money plus the rest of the financial realm financial realm that Bill Gates operates into and he's going to give it to the righteous. So Trump shall become a trumpet one, says the Lord. Trump shall become a trumpet two. I will raise up Trump to become a trumpet and Bill Gates to open up the, the gate of a financial realm. In other words, where Bill Gates is operating in. Darkness. A financial realm. And all that money that him and his co-operations, uh, operators, that have stored up for themselves on earth, not in heaven, is coming to the church. I'll give you the riches in secret places, or riches in darkness. I'll give you the treasures in darkness. God is, you know what I'm talking about. So, Bill Gates' gate is going to be opened up. And his financial realm is going to come to the righteous, to the church. So, as I said, remember, I'm giving you a date here, yeah? the 22nd to the 23rd of February, 2022. Is that 22, 20, 2022 again? And we've had a lot happen on this 22, this month. But it's going to be 22 noon to 23 noon. That 24 hour period. Something big and biblical is going to happen there. This is what I'm hearing in the spirit. And of course, Japan had a 6.6 .6 yesterday on the uh, 22nd, 22, 2022. And uh, the other prophecy speaks about a twin in the ground. And, but uh, in a destructive, it'll be destructive, but it'll unveil that is hidden away in darkness. And uh, so six plus six is twelve, a half a dozen, seven and a half a dozen of the other. Seven and a half a dozen of the other. So seven point six. And uh, West Coast, California, Ivory Towers. Take it all in, into consideration. Ivory Towers and their gods. Financial realm. You know, the God of money. Worshipping money. So Ivory Towers, West Coast, gonna collapse. The gods won't be able to help them in the presence of God. 
have no power in the presence of God because it's going to take it all away. There will be nothing left for them. So, that's why uh, God has dropped into my spirit for today. And you have the two prophecies from the beginning, which I read as one prophecy. And uh, I believe all these prophecies that I'm giving you now are going to be manifesting themselves in the next three to four months. And maybe sooner. Sooner. Much sooner. Anyway, God bless you. And may His favor drip from every part of you. In Jesus' name. Amen. I will fight. I will fight for you. I always do until my heart is black and blue. And I will stay. I will stay with you. We'll make it to 